In 2023, a new crop of billionaires emerged in the world of sports, and we're here to introduce you to the top 15 of these billionaires who are involved with Formula One. With an updated list, the newest billionaire on the block didn't quite make it into the top 15, but he definitely deserves an honorable mention. In April 2023, Dorger Christian, better known as Toto Wolf, at 51 years old, was recognized by Forbes as the newest billionaire in the sports realm, with a fortune estimated at $1 billion. He not only serves as the head of the Mercedes team but also owns a 33% stake in the team. When he joined Mercedes, he acquired 30% of the team for $30 million. His annual income went from $200 million in 2013 to around $450 million in 2022. He also has other investments outside of Formula One, which pushed his earnings to that impressive $1 billion mark. However, even with this substantial wealth, he didn't make it onto this list, which is just beginning. Now, on to Jaffe, the Italian-American businessman, 47 years old, with an estimated fortune of $1.7 billion. The Agnelli family dynasty dates back to 1899 when Giovanni Agnelli, John's great-great-grandfather, founded Fiat in Turin, Italy. John took on a leadership role in the Fiat family business in 2004, a year after his grandfather's passing, who chose him as the heir responsible for the family's companies. EXOR, controlled by the Agnelli family, of which he is the CEO, holds a majority stake in Ferrari. In 2018, he was named the CEO of the Scuderia, and in 2020, he took on the role of CEO full-time. Next up is an American cosmetics entrepreneur who stands out on this list as the only one who didn't inherit his wealth. At 79 years old, he's accumulated an estimated fortune of $2.9 billion. Living in Austin, Texas, he's an avid motorsport enthusiast. His interest in the circuit of the Americas and Formula One sparked as soon as the project was presented. He and his wife attended their first Formula One Grand Prix in 1995, witnessing Michael Schumacher's victory in Monaco that year. He fell in love with Formula One and couldn't wait to get involved when the chance to bring Formula One to Texas through a facility like the Circuit of the Americas came up. In 12th place, we find a familiar face. Once a hero, now a villain, Bernie Ecclestone, the former head of Formula One, appears on this list with a fortune estimated at $2.9 billion. He transformed Formula One from a niche racing competition into a global phenomenon during his illustrious four-decade career. Nicknamed the Formula One Supremo by the British tabloids, he stepped down from leading the sport in 2017 when Liberty Media purchased Formula One for $4.4 billion. Today, he serves as an advisor to the sport, occasionally making appearances, but many are glad he's no longer in charge. Finally, we have Papayan Stroll, whose wealth didn't quite crack the top 10. At 64 years old, the majority owner of Aston Martin's Formula One team boasts a fortune evaluated at $3.8 billion. He made significant gains in the fashion sector, particularly through selling his shares in Michael Kors. Additionally, his involvement in the Racing Point team led to the team's rebranding as Aston Martin in 2020, marking the brand's return to Formula One after 60 years. Papayan Stroll is one of the most prominent and controversial figures in the paddock during race weekends, as he not only leads one of the teams but also shoulders the responsibility of his son's performance within the team. So, there you have it, the top 15 billionaires in Formula One for 2023. Each of them has their own unique story and path to riches in the world of motorsport. It's important to note that this list doesn't include the various Middle Eastern billionaires involved in Formula One, as the lack of precise information about their fortunes makes it challenging to rank them. These individuals have made their mark in the sport, and their wealth is a testament to their success. Formula One has a diverse group of billionaire stakeholders, each contributing to the excitement and prestige of the sport.